this little creek. So drop the point on Onyx so we know it. And then also we can kind of just guesstimate where it is up on top too. So if we ever get up on top of the ridge, it's a good, always good thinking just to drop the pin on water um, every time you come across it. Then you can kind of tell where it's going up the creek or going down the creek and get in the pinch. But yeah, this year we're using uh, the Sawyer Squeeze and Zach uh, has had a lot of success with it over the last couple weekends. And so we're just gonna fill it up and hydrate. It takes no time at all to get it out, fill it up, take some sips and keep moving. So we just kind of said after last weekend with the whole ordeal, we're just gonna keep these in our pack. Every time we come across them, whip them out, get some water, top off, get moving. Maybe sit for five minutes, you know? So yeah, just always good. These things are super awesome, super lightweight. Roll up into nothing, shove them in your Nalgene pocket, your, your backpack, come across some water, pop it out, hydrate, you're out. Five minutes. Yeah, the thing that's super cool about that Sawyer Squeeze is um, it's super versatile. As you can see, Jeff just has it hooked up to the actual like squeeze system uh, bladder that comes with it. Um, you can buy different bladders that are a little more, uh, I guess, uh, puncture proof than that one. That one's a little, little bit weak, but if you keep it inside your pack, you won't have an issue. Um, but the Sawyer Squeeze, it can screw onto that it can screw onto like a regular size water bottle or like a those bigger smart water bottles um, and so you can just like fill that up and drink straight out of it you don't have to worry about you know pumping into a into a bladder or anything like that you can just grab it and go so it's a quick like on the move type system and then you can also buy a quick connect system to run it in line with a bladder if you want to go that route um, so yeah, they're, they're super versatile. They're really easy. And um, what are they, 20 bucks, 25 bucks? Yeah, I think it was 29.99 or somewhere right in there at REI. Yeah. And um, and last year with the with the bee, free, the bee freezing that, yeah. we, that we had problems with, the yep. Sawyer seems like it would, I mean, granted we haven't used it for nine days straight for dudes, but mm -hmm. um, I would give it a higher star than that bee free. Yep. It, it looks, it has a better, faster stream. Yep. It has a better system. Yep. There's one downside is that the bladder and the system itself might weigh more than the Bee Free. Mm -hmm. But for all in all, I think that that Sawyer is a better system. Yeah, I think the actual Sawyer squeeze, just the filter, is like four ounces. Yeah. So it's still insanely light. Um, I think if we were doing like a group camp, we'd probably still have a Catadyne like pump system. The big pump. Yeah. Um, just for doing like bulk water, but as far as just like running trail and like being on the move, it I think it'd be hard to beat this Sawyer Squeeze. So if you're in the market for a new uh, water filter or you want to try something different, I suggest it. And we're not even we're like Sawyer's not a sponsor or nothing. No, it's just another cool product that we enjoy, so we want to share it with everyone. So um, with that being said, we're gonna drink a little bit more water and keep on going. We got about three more miles to go probably and hopefully turn up a buck and shoot it tonight and that'd be great so we're out